Hello friends, uh, welcome to this session of Success Stories. Today we have with us a friend who got trained through us and also got placed in one of the companies where I was in the past, right? Her name is Vishali. Hi Vishali. Hi Thank sir. Thank you so much for providing your time. So I'm honored so, to be this time with you. So the first question that I have is uh, Vishali. What is your educational background and how did you get into this field of data science? Can you throw some light on that? Yeah, uh, so sir, I have completed my graduation in uh, computer applications, BCA, in 2021. So later after this, I became a new mom immediately after graduation. So I was doing my work from home, take a, doing a full-time parenting. Uh, but uh, it is it was always uh, like I wanted to get into a bigger organization, get into a good job. It was like a dream job for me and uh, I was always inspired by the idea of data science. So I wanted to get certified professionally uh, in a very good place where I get recognized, where I get to learn everything well. So that is when I found 360, 360 Digital MG and then uh, I just joined. I didn't have a second thought because uh, people who gave counseling about what data science is explained everything. I just joined without any second thought and uh, the trainers were really good. So that's how I got into data science actually. Wonderful. Yeah. <clears throat> so you already had computer science background, right? Correct. BC. Yes. But then uh, you are now a parent as well, right? Yeah. So it would have been very difficult for you to cope up, but yet you cracked it. Yeah. So it's all about perseverance is what I feel. <clears throat> so yeah. for our uh, friends, can you and, and you have also worked on a few projects, I believe, the real world projects that yes. we provide. Yes, yes. So, how did that help you, Vishali, in cracking the interview? Can you throw yes. some light on that? Yes, sir. So, uh, the moment I started uh, doing my course, uh, first few days it was so excited I, because I was getting to learn new things. Then later it was like it's not cup of, my cup of tea. Um, it was like a downtime. And then I bounced back with all a trainer's reassurance. And then after completing my course successfully with all the assignments uh, given by Institute, I got this opportunity to work in live project offered uh, from uh, 360 and this live project was a life changer for me because uh, everything I applied practically I get got to under understanding about uh, how to work in end-to-end -end project what is the each process to work in a business level project and uh, mentors were very supporting to me in this point of view because uh, when I started doing my first project it was very complicated for me to understand meet the deadlines uh, so, but uh, overall, it was a very good experience, and the project is the one which helped me get into a job. Honestly, because I also worked in a research paper for my very first project, so that's the one which helped me get into a job. Because interview was very happy when I told I worked in a research paper, and he was like completely like, okay, then I have no other questions for you. Wow, wow, so yeah. nice to know. All these things are extremely motivating. Yeah, you know that. Uh, you, you truly differentiated your profile from the other profiles, I believe, right? The moment you said that your project details got published on international journal, then not many people will have anything to say. That is, itself proves that you are one of the best. Thank you, sir. I'm wonderful. Here and uh, if you were to give, okay, okay, I think I, I, I'm just walking around on this campus, which is called as. University of Pennsylvania, which is one of the Ivy Leagues. Yeah. Okay. So, if you were to give one uh, suggestion mm -hmm. to the students who are currently undergoing this training or the students who have just completed their training, mm -hmm. what would that be, Vishali, for them sir, to get into this field of data science? Yeah, sir. So, I would say give your 200% while you're working in a project. And always be behind a trainer. So they are the one who's going to help you more, uh, give a better understanding. So 200% in the project and uh, taking as much as knowledge possible from the trainer. I think these two suggestions I would like to give to them and uh, constantly keep working. Do not do not lose patience. There you go, guys. Give your not 100%, 200% when you work on projects. And um, on a daily basis, we also ask questions while you do the project prepare that will be a recap okay everyone's intelligence won't be the same every person's grasping level won't be the same 
yeah so respect your brain respect your intelligence and grasping level and put in more hard work thank yeah thank you, you thank you so much uh, uh, vishali it was a pleasure talking with you and thank all you the sir. very best okay uh, which company have you joined and what is your designation for the audience can you just see that so as well? uh, sir i have joined a company called itc infotech so my uh, position is associate data scientist is2 so it's wonderful yeah. i worked with itc infotech from 2000 Uh, 7 until 2010 i believe yeah. that's great so yeah enjoy thank you so much thank you, thank you sir thank you it was great meeting you thank you